Hi, in this video I will demonstrate how you can create custom dashboards in VMware vRealize Operations Manager. Although VMware vRealize Operations comes preloaded with some amazing dashboards to get you going on day one, you can even create custom VMware vRealize Operations dashboards. You need to own the advanced or enterprise editions of vRealize Operations Manager. Let's log in to VMware vRealize Operations Manager Admin Console. The first step we need to do is laying out the dashboards. On the home page, navigate to Dashboards and click on Actions and choose Create Dashboard. Drag and drop the appropriate widgets to the dashboard layout area. These widgets will show information about attributes, resources, applications, or the overall processes in the environment. You can configure widgets to reflect your specific needs or to provide or accept data from one or more widgets. In this video, I will be creating custom dashboard displaying health, top alerts, anomalies, related objects, etc. of a set of Ubuntu application servers. By default, an object list will display much more than our Ubuntu application servers. Once we have all the widgets in place in the dashboard layout area, next step is to configure interactions between the widgets. Click on Show Interaction and configure the interaction. Click on Save once interactions are configured between widgets. By default widgets is configured to show much more data than needed as they are configured to display the data by itself as well. Let's configure the widget as child so that it won't show the data by itself and will show the data based on inputs received from parent widget. Let's create an another dashboard to show the details of disk latency, read-write IOPS, disk usage, etc. We need to repeat the same steps as we did earlier i.e. designing a layout, configuring widgets as child, configuring widgets interactions. Once configured you will be able to see the details of the capacity disk while are part of vSAN data store. We can see, at this point of time widgets are not displaying desired data and is showing the default data. As we want to see the specific information on disk latency, disk usage, etc. we need to configure widget to show those disk metrics only. Let's configure the widgets as child and add the desired metrics under output data. This concludes the demo, where we created custom dashboards to get granular details of the virtual machines and disk details of the underlying capacity disk in a vSAN data store. Hope this will be informative for you. Please do share, like and comment if you find worth sharing it. Thanks for watching, happy learning.